we have another thing that's going to work this way. We have a couple of cups. We're going to roll down the track, and we're going to have a race. And each of you gets to have one of these two. Tierney, go ahead and push yours up at the top of the track, and let it go. And yours nicely rolls all the way down the track. Lisa, try yours, and let's see if we can have what happens with yours. Put it at the top of the track, track and let it go, and... Huh? You lost it. <laughs> and I want you to try that again. And I want you to make it go all the way down the track. All the way down the track. Oh, no! Is that possible? <laughs> try it again and see. And, in fact, it is possible. And this is, this is our positive feedback cup. You can see, if it started to go just ever so slightly to the left, it rolls harder to the left. And if it starts to go just a little bit to the right, what happens? It rolls harder to the left. that one doesn't go, like, fall off. That's our negative feedback cup. And with this one, you can see, as it's rolling down the track, as it starts to go this way, it's on the bigger part, and then it just makes it roll even harder to the left. A little turn to the left turns into a big turn to the left. And so if I try to get it perfectly centered and perfectly straight, uh-oh, it wasn't perfectly straight. And that small difference kind of like pushed it that way. And let's try the other cups. But check this out, a little tiny turn to the left, and watch what happens. It goes back to the right, and then goes to the right, goes back to the left, and so it stabilizes it. And there's things like that that happen in the Earth's climate as well. Some kinds of clouds, for instance, when it gets warm, water evaporates, rises, makes clouds. But when clouds go up in the sky, what does it block? The sun. The sun. Sunlight. And then that can keep it cooler. And that's an example of a negative, a negative feedback. And so you get these kind of like changes that happen.